Hey, my fellow Lego fans. Welcome to another edition of My Life with Lego. This old Lego brick here. And this is the moment you've been waiting for. Mm, perhaps some of you. I have lost a few subscribers. Anyway, the details of my Hawaiian minifig giveaway. So, um... Let me explain. So, when I had reached 500 subscribers, I wanted to do something special and unique uh, to say thank you. And I'm almost approaching a thousand subscribers, so thanks even more. So this is what I decided to do. My family and I are going vacation to Hawaii. Now I can't take everybody with us, so um, instead, I am going to try to do the next best thing and take my personal sig fig right here. There he is. And I'm going to take him to Hawaii. And we're going to have lots of adventures together. And when I get back, I'm going to send him to one of my subscribers. One of you. So in order to qualify, all you have to do is like, be a subscriber and leave a comment below for this video there are a few more things first i have to know whether you are a subscriber or not so if you keep that information private i will not be able to see it on my youtube dashboard second um the comments have to show up uh, I do delete spam. YouTube also does it for me. And uh, any vulgar comments and stuff like that, I will personally delete. And so therefore you won't be qualified. Sorry, just nice stuff. Just say, hey, or her mom was a butthead. I mean, that's fine, I guess. But um, she's not, she's really a fantastic lady. But other than that, you know, I'm pretty lenient. But uh, something too vulgar, I, I will delete it. Now a close-up of my sig fig. There he is. And he also does have a reverse face. He looks a little worried there, doesn't he? And I also try to send something else along besides sick big, maybe some Hawaiian sand or I don't know, something. I'll think of something and uh, package it all up together and send it to the lucky winner. All right, now for other news. So I have a lot of things planned for the channel when I return from vacation and beyond. So I will probably be trying some new shows i played around with Lego news for a bit. I might continue doing that. I still have plenty of ideas for Lego news, but um, I want to do something a little more creative. And so I have a few things in mind, but it requires a little more script work uh, than what Lego news required. So be on the lookout for that. And the beyond part, I've been playing Lego chess with my son recently. So as we were playing this game, several thoughts came to me. Uh, one of them was, hey, I'm a game designer. That's what I do for a living. I design games, uh, mainly role-playing games, but I have a few board game and card game ideas. So I sat down my computer whipped something up, sent it off to the printers. It's there now being printed. It's going to be sent back, hopefully by the time I get back, and I can show you what I had in mind. It's going to be terrific, I promise. So I combined my love for Lego, my love for chess, and my love for zany games and rolled it into one and um, let me see what um, comes up so i'm sorry no logo update this month but 
it is what it is. Matter of fact, my Lego room is a bit of a mess and the town has been spread apart a little bit. I've had a few casualties. But instead of a Lego update, I do want to show you the condition of the room. <laughs> I don't know why. And um, my plans for it. So, um, come on. Let's go. Take a look. So here is the state of the town right now. Ugh. And I did have one casualty with the slope road, but it can be easily fixed. I'm not worried. And I'm rearranging the town at the moment, kind of figuring out how I want things to go. I have plenty of blue plates here. I'm gonna to try to start working on the canal and extend it but I've had a problem and I'll show you what it is. So I wanted to rearrange this strip of plates, these buildings, and put the bridge adjacent to a corner. So basically the train would come around here and enter into the bridge area. Problem is, when I built it, if you look under here, the train bumps right into this, these two sections here. And so therefore I can't have a corner adjacent to the bridge unless I do some reworking on the bridge. And I'm not really willing to do that just yet. So as of right now, I put everything kind of back, the strip back, and now I'm just trying to figure out what buildings I want to elevate, which ones I don't, and how they're going to be arranged. You can see I'm playing around with the idea of the canal running through here so I can have some ships. Trying to figure out what corner buildings will go on which corner. See, I have a lot of mess to clean up. Here's something you don't really see all the time when I'm doing my videos, so I'll just give you a quick kind of look around here. A lot of devastation. A lot of jumbled mess here. I want to incorporate all this into the town too, so I'm, I'm, I'm trying to organize everything. So that's that's really what's been preventing me. I mean, I have been sick and catching up on work, but and here's one of my mocks up here. Really, really proud of this one. The shipwreck. I did that a while ago. Long, long time ago. And just a lot of travesty right over here. So you see guys and gals, just a bit of a jumble mess. Let me pan back a little bit so you can kind of see the room as a whole. Uh, hopefully when I get back I can start organizing things and getting back to a regular schedule figure out where I want to put everything, how I want to connect it, and move forward.
So be sure to look out next week. I will probably doing some videos. I'm going to hope to do some videos next week while on vacation to show you where me and my sig fig are going and what we're doing. And if not, be sure to follow me on Instagram because I definitely would be putting photographs up almost every opportunity. So until next time, happy building. And if you haven't done so, please like subscribe and remember to leave that comment below for this video. All right. And I will see you guys soon.